Hey everybody, uh, I'm coming to you via a audio, an audio tape, an audio message because it's a little easier for me because I got so much information that I want to kind of pass along. All right, we had, uh, I had one of our cousins asked me a question and I'm going really fast, I'm talking really, really fast because there's a time limit to how long this audio, this file can be. Uh, you know, so that I can kind of upload it to uh, YouTube to get the message to you. But anyway, uh, she so one of our cousins uh, asked a question if she's not much of a bowler, she's not a bowler, and she doesn't really care for pizza, will she have to pay the $25 fee? Uh, and I called and uh, talked to the manager of the bowling alley about, you know, uh, some of the things that I'm sharing with you guys so that uh, I knew what I was talking about. But anyway, so the answer to that question is no. If you're not going to bowl and you're not going to eat pizza, you don't have to pay anything. All you have to do is just show up at the bowling alley and just have fun with the fam. And we do want you there. So don't feel, you know, like funny or strange or, you know, uncomfortable because you're not going to be bowling or you're not going to eat. It doesn't matter. You, if, you, if you're there just cheerleading and, and rooting us on, <laughs> you know, you can do that please do that also for those of you who may not have the money to participate okay if you don't have the money to participate to, to bowl and 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 um, you know eat pizza or whatever you just don't have the money and you want to save your money for the, the theater and the when we go out to eat hey do that too you don't have to bowl or eat but we want you to come so I knew that phone was gonna ring hold on y'all I gotta see who that is I don't know who that is anyway so uh yeah so p please do come either way whatever just come now if you're not going to pay if you're not if you're not going to pay the twenty five dollars or the money towards the event you know still let me know you're coming you know if you if you're not because I don't know whether you're not paying because you just you know uh, uh, procrastinating or what I mean call me and say I'm not going to be you know uh, bowling or eating pizza or whatever but I'll be there please let me know that please okay all right that's that um also I do want to mention that Auntie Bitsy she was just over here just like she left like five minutes ago Auntie Bitsy is going to be giving us pointers on how to throw our balls you know to strike and all that kind of stuff because y'all know she's on the league and so she's going to be there giving us some pointers and, and helping us out some of y'all know how to bowl some of us don't and we could use some help all right uh let's see what else now i asked the manager another question i didn't think about this before uh but i just thought about it so i asked i asked her what if uh uh what it would cost if we had a group come in you know to just bowl only no food uh, I asked her how much it would cost and she said twelve dollars per person as opposed to twenty five dollars per person twelve dollars per person and this would include shoes also <clears throat> <clears throat> so I was thinking uh, I was thinking that we could do that package where we just you know pay to bowl because we are going to the movies afterwards okay so we're only going to be bowling for two hours the the package is for uh, two hours for the for the lanes um, and so anyway we, you know we're going to go bowling afterwards and you know popcorn tastes a whole lot better when you're hungry so I don't know if we you know do all that eating at the bowling alley and then we go to the theaters we're not going to be hungry for you know for anything so um, not to mention we're going to be going out to eat after we leave the theater that's another thing we're going to eat after we leave the theater um, Debbie and I uh, were going over some places uh, to eat in the area some some places where we can go and eat uh, in the area of where the theater is by the way which is uh, uh, on Cicero um, the uh, over in uh, Crestwood and there are plenty of pay plenty of places to eat so we don't have to worry about it. we can leave the theater and then go you know to get something to eat um, and we don't have to really do much in, in terms of travel and and what I'm gonna do I'm gonna send out an email or another audio with probably an email 
uh, you know, giving you the, the places in that area where we can eat. And, and also the movies that are going to be playing on Saturday. Okay, so I'm going to look at, you know, uh, and I'll have that information for you, if not tonight, definitely tomorrow. Uh, so that we will know in advance what movies are playing. But we can decide what movie we're going to go see uh, on Saturday. So when we get there as a group, we'll just kind of talk amongst ourselves. What do you want to see? What do you want to see? And we'll come up with a movie to go see. And hopefully we'll all go to the same movie. And I hope it's something that we can get in there and just laugh. Okay. Uh, you know, something funny. It can be something serious or whatever. It don't matter. Uh, anyway, so I want your thoughts. I want your thoughts, you guys, on whether you want to just do the, the bowling. You want to do the bowling with pizza package, which is $25, or just the bowling package, where it's just bowling, that's $12. Okay, so I want you to give me your thoughts on that. Please respond back to me ASAP as soon as possible. Please, people. Police, as soon as you get this this audio message, as soon as you get it, respond back to me immediately and say, "Hey, I would like us to do the pizza, the 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 bowling and the pizza." Or respond back to me and say, "I would like to do just the bowling, and I will you will just do well majority rules." So, uh, so anyway, so please don't don't delay, please. I have to sign this contract on Wednesday, and uh, you know, so I need to know whatever it is I need to know. I need to know it, uh, ASAP. Now, here's another thing I need to mention. This is one of those please notes. Either way, whether we're doing the $25 or we're doing the $12, I still have to have that money in hand when I go in and sign that contract. When I sign the contract, I have to have the money in hand because the number of lanes that we're going to be secured, that are going to be secured and guaranteed, are based on the number of people who have paid. That's what it's going to be based on. The number of people who have paid is going to be based on that. So that's why I need, for those of you who have not paid, and I just want to say to those of you who have paid, you know, I appreciate you getting your money in. Uh, but for those of you who haven't, you need to get it in. Now, I got to hurry up. Uh, now, for uh, those of you who have already paid and we opt to just do the bowling, I will reimburse you what, you know, uh, your your other $13. Now, if those of you who have not paid, uh, you have basically two options. It's too late, I guess, to mail it in. Uh, what you can do is I set up a, a button where you can pay using a credit card on the Internet. I, and it'll go right to my PayPal account, okay? www at go, go at www.kathyupshire, Kathy with a C, that's all one word, dot com forward slash ladies ladies day out dot html ladies l a d i e s ladies day out dot html www.kathyupshire dot com forward slash ladies day out dot html and pay you can pay by credit card and I'll get it immediately right away okay um, that site is secure when you click on that pay now button it takes you to the PayPal site it's a secure site PayPal does not allow me to see your credit card number so all I see is your name and address like who who paid so go and do that um, and uh, and I would appreciate that okay so I've made it easy for those of you who waited to last minute <laughs> I love you. I love your people. I love you, family. But you got to pay so that we can do, so that I can do what I need to do so we can start our uh, Ladies' Day off right. So, uh, again, go to the website. Or the other option is, uh, especially, especially for those of you who live here in Chicago, uh, you can um, just drive out here to Auntie Dorothy's house and just drop the money by. Just bring it by here, okay? And uh, that will work, too. If you're going to bring a money order, please don't bring the money order on Tuesday night. If you bring it Tuesday night, bring cash, okay? Because then, you know, uh, that's going to put me under the wire as far as cashing, the, cashing it. So get it to me as soon as possible. You can reach me at, by email. You can reach me by phone, 708-333-4503 or on Facebook. Well, until I hear from you, talk to you later. Or you can call me. If you pay by by uh, on the website, please email me and let me know you did so. Bye bye.